Hello friends and welcome back to yet another video. My name is Budget with D, and on this channel we talk all things cash stuff in, budgeting and small business related. So in this video, if you haven't guessed by the title, we are doing yet another cash stuff in video. Today we've got £530 to staff, but before we do that, I'm going to move this off to the side as always, because we've got a bonus envelope to fill out. Now this right here is £30 that I have made from Vinted Sales, so this will be going towards my savings challenges, which is why I put it to the side so it doesn't get mixed up. Um, so I'm just going to leave it to the side so that, you know, I don't mix it up. <laughs> so I'm just going to go into my weekly essential binder and we're going to see what we can put away into this bonus envelope. So eh, this one is not being done today. Uh, the gas and electric, we've still got £20 in there, lovely, lovely. Um, we do really need some to be fair, but I've been really stretching it out um, and I'm glad that I did because this way we've got £20 going in towards our savings. Uh, in Little Man's Essentials, we've still got £8 left. So we're off to a brilliant start already. And then in personal, we've got a lot of change. A lot of change. <laughs> uh, but that's alright because that just means that we've got more to add to the penny saving challenge, am I right? Alright, so I'm gonna take out the pounds. Gonna fish them out really quick. All of them. Yeah, so all of this, which is under a pound, I'm going to put in my little pot here, which is going to go towards my penny saving challenge. There we go. So we've got two, four, six pounds left over from my personal budget. Um, should we do a dicey challenge? Um, yeah, let's do a dicey challenge. So I'm going to bring out my lovely little potty pot. Potty pot. <laughs> I'm going to move this off to the side quickly. And what I'm using this one, if you haven't heard, so I've got six pounds here, so I'm going to use some of these coins and I'm going to pop them into here um, and mark it off on my tracker before I forget. Um, so this is the first six pounds. How exciting. Right, there we go. Uh, I'm going to do one of these as well just to complete a row just to be satisfied. But yeah, if you haven't heard uh, in one of my previous videos, what I'm using the Dicer Challenge for is, um, so at the end of it, I'll save 189 pounds and I'll be putting that towards my 100 envelope challenge to boost that, to try and get that filled as soon as possible because it's a big old challenge. <laughs> um, so yeah, that's what I'm using that for. And then the money that is left over from the weekly budget is going to go towards getting us a holiday for next year, which is very exciting because we've never actually been on a proper holiday. So woohoo for that. <laughs> so going into the bonus envelope today, we've got £27. Love that, love that, love that a lot. So I'm just going to pop it in. There we go, that can go and be added into my box now. And I will be opening these up uh, when we get to 30 weeks. So we've got six weeks left, but I don't know, I might even do it sooner. Just because I want to get this all put <laughs> in the bank, if I'm honest. Um, but I will be doing it for one year. So the savings won't stop once we open it. <laughs> we'll keep, keep working towards it. But yeah, so now that we've done that, we can bring our money over and just arrange it all nicely. So this is the money that is from Vinted that will be going towards the savings challenges. So let's just jump straight into it. Starting off in my weekly essentials folder, ignoring the weekly food shop because that is done separately. Gas and electric, as always, is getting 100 pounds. I just realised that I didn't even count the cash, <laughs> but I feel like sometimes 
that can drag it out a bit anyway. So let me know if you prefer having, um, if you prefer me counting the cash in the video or not, um, and we can go from there. But yeah, I had 530, not 500, 430 pounds. It's gas and electric, little man's essentials, as always, is getting 30 pounds as well. Apologies if things went different, my neighbour come home and I got scared so I hid. <laughs> Go straight back into it. Little Man's Essentials is now done. Personal is also getting £30 as usual. Had a little bit more in there last time but uh, yeah back to normal this well this cash stuff. I keep going to say this week but it's not a, a weekly thing, it's a bi-weekly is that the correct term? But every two weeks. Um, home upgrades is not getting anything but I am putting am I? Family time's not getting anything but rainy day fund is getting 10 and I really really need to go and update these tra um, the trackers in here but I still haven't gotten around to doing that surprise surprise so that's everything for my essentials binder we can move on now to my sinking funds starting off in self-care I'm putting 10 pounds into here Health and medication is not getting anything. Little man's clothes is getting. Mm, yeah, little man's clothes is getting twenty pounds today. I'm gonna pop that in. Get him some summer clothes soon. That'll be fun. Family birthdays. I'm putting ten pounds into here today. There we go. Therapy is not getting anything. Neither is Costco. My tattoo fund is getting £10 today. And there we go. And driving lessons is also getting £10 today. <laughs> and there we go. So that is everything for my sinking, sinking funds binder as well. Uh, so we can move on now to the savings challenges, which is my personal favourite. So kicking it off with Christmas, I'm going to take the tracker out first, there we go, so I'm going to be putting £30 into here today, so I'm going to cross one of these off, there we go, might as well put the money in there first, I'm actually really looking forward to Christmas this year, <laughs> considering I'm not going to be going into debt for it. So yeah, there's Christmas fun done. So Penny Saving Challenge as always is getting £10, so I'm just going to put it off into this pot here. However, I do need some tens for my upcoming budgets, and I do have some of them in here, so I'm just going to exchange a few of them for some 20s. One, two, three, four, so I'll do that. And then I'll just put two of these back in here. There we go. We can keep going. My £10 saving challenge is also getting £10. But well, once again, I have to go through the trackers because recently we went out, so I kind of took a little bit out of random wallets. Um, and as I saw Sean from Budget with Sean say, it's my budget, so I do what I want, basically. <laughs> and I love that. So it's my budget, and I'm not sorry. <laughs> Didn't even end up spending most of it anyway, but yeah, I'm gonna be building this back up. Yeah, I think there's 30 pounds in there or something at the moment, but yeah, not important. Uh, little man's birthday is getting five pounds, but what I'm gonna do is take five out, put a 10 in, um, and I'm gonna mark one of these up. Okay. So there's that one. This is one of my favourite designs, personally. But there's that one done. And then Reese's birthday is getting the other five. Now both of their birthdays are not until the beginning of next year now, so I'm really not worried. I can take my leisurely time with these now. Even if it is five pounds at a time. <laughs> so yeah. And then Lithuania fund is getting an extra £20 and I will be using this soon to 
buy some tickets for us to go, which is really exciting. I'm really, really excited to go over and see my family. And if you're watching, hey guys. <laughs> so little man's future is getting 10 pounds today. Is that right? Yes, 10 pounds and I've decided I'm gonna change the tracker that's in here so I'm not gonna bother marking it off anyway. I'm just gonna change it for a 10 pound challenge because that's what I seem to put in there more often. Um, so yeah. And then the new home fund is gonna be getting a 10 as well. Just gonna mark one of these off. And then because I do actually need a 10, now I'm gonna take a 10 out and put 20 in. That always confuses me. So that is the cash stuffing complete, which bum, 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 leaves us with 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 100. So what I'm gonna be doing is putting 30 pounds into my mystery tin and the remaining 70 towards my 100 envelope challenge. But wait, <laughs> we've got an extra 30 pounds. So like I said at the beginning of the video, this 30 pounds come from some sales that I made on Vinted. So what I'm actually gonna do is put 20 pounds towards the mystery tin, because I did say that the majority of the money, like the side hustle money, so like Vinted, eBay, Depop, that kind of stuff, is gonna be going in the mystery tin. But I'm gonna give the 100 envelope challenge a 10 pound boost because why not? So there will be 50 pounds going into the mystery tin and there will be 80 pounds going towards the 100 envelope challenge, which now leads us to the very end of this video. And thank you so much for sticking around to the end if you made it this far. And I really hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you found something useful or maybe you just enjoyed chilling and watching. Please do leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you enjoyed and please do give this video a thumbs up as well and do subscribe to the channel if you would like to see more videos like this in the future. And all that being said, I'm gonna love you and leave you as always. Have a fabulous, fabulous day and happy cash stuffing. <laughs> see you in the next one, guys. Bye.